Good day guys, Salchi Seagull back again. Um, this week, before we get into the tutorial, I just wanted to ask you guys uh, for a bit of feedback. Um, I, I want to hear from you guys, guys who watch my videos, uh, what you would like to see next. What kind of tutorials are you guys looking for? Uh, either in the A10C, the Mirage 2000, or the F18 Hornet. Uh, I'm going to be getting into the F18 Hornet tutorial soon but yeah I just want, want some feedback from you guys and uh, if you guys have anything you need to know or would like me to do a tutorial on throw it down in the comments below okay with that out the way today we're going to be looking at inputting waypoints into the CDU um, while in flight in the A10C Warthog so we're here flying over the Caucasus as you can see and um, what we're going to do is we're going to bring up the F10 map. So what we can do is, first of all, we need to change our coordinate system. Okay, we want to change it. We're going to use Alt and Y on the keyboard. And we're going to hit that twice until we get to this, which is our degrees and decimals. I don't know the exact format what this is called, but this is the format we needed it. So we'll pick a spot here. Yeah, it's a guta somewhere. Okay, so basically you hover your mouse at a spot. So we'll take that intersection of the power line and load, for example. You'll see the coordinates in the top left corner of the screen. So we've got our northing, which is 43 degrees 000 115. Okay, so we're going to go back into our cockpit now. And I'll show you. You can bring your CDU screen up on your right MFD, but we're going to be we're going to have to select a certain page on it in our CDU down here. So we're going to select the OSET page here. And that's going to bring up, you see on our right NFT here, we've got the coordinates and then the waypoint number we'll be editing. So now using our key scratch pad up under the HUD here, we can put in that coordinate. So let's go back and check it out. It is, our northing is. 43 degrees 00, zero decimal 116. So we'll put that in 43 zero, zero, 116. You see that in there, and we're going to hit this OSB here for our northing, and you see that's in there. Now we're going to have to do our easting again, F10 map, and it's 04, well, this says 41 degrees 02 decimal 422. Okay, because it's our easting, we're going to put a zero in. Oh, shit, I forgot what it was. What was it again? 0410242. In memory of a net. 02423. Zero two four two three, and you can see it there. By the way, you can also see it on the bottom of the hard watch you're inputting there. Okay, if you don't put that zero in front, it's going to throw up an error, and you're going to have to clear that out. So we'll put that in there, select in our easting, and then the final step we'll do is we'll hit that four icon here and that will set it to our waypoint 4 don't know why I'm picking up a missile launch goddamn training missions oh, nothing's hit us yet oh, someone's launching from above there anyhow so now basically in order to go to that waypoint we're going to now hit our step point rocker here up and look in the bottom right corner of the HUD and there is our 4 in the same 004 okay so that's basically and then we've now as you can see here we've got waypoint 5 so we could put waypoint 5 in there I'm going to give you an example there okay so let's put 4102 
four, two, three. Okay, we're gonna put this into the east thing, and you'll see you see you get the CDU input area error. In order to clear that, you'll hit the clear button here, and then you can start again and put the zero in. That's just an example of what happens uh, if you put a cor incorrect coordinate in. Okay, alrighty, and then we can basically now use our HUD navigation here to turn on to our waypoint heading. Okay, so basically that's how I put in waypoints in flight. So for example, you might have a built-in way a set of waypoints that you have before you take off. You can also see that waypoint here on the marked as four here on the tab. Um, but yeah, basically if you have a set of waypoints you take off with, but for example, you're given coordinates to a specific target and, and you want to navigate there relatively easily, this is how you can actually do that. Input them in into the OSET page there and add it into your flight plan as an extra waypoint. Um, yeah, I hope that's useful to you guys. Um, please feel free to add some input in the comments below. Um, yeah, and catch you next week for the next tutorial. Thanks for watching, guys. Cheers.